Hi students, my name is Dina Khalayli, you can call me Dina. I'm from Deir Hanna. It's a beautiful village in the north. Let's start, okay? We will have lots of fun. I am very happy to be here with you and I hope you are too. So please keep smiling and let's have some fun. Let's start. Okay, what will we do today? First, the first thing we will do, we will learn one of the A sounds. The second thing we will do, we'll read new words. The third thing, we will learn the meaning of new words. Okay, I have a question. Let me ask you, can you, now, if you look now, can you say the short A sound, the A? Mm, I don't think so. Can you match rhyming words? Do you know what a rhyming word is? I don't think so. Can you read new words? I don't know that much. So let's learn with Dina and let's have some fun and learn the, these things. Okay, what do, we, what do we need for our lesson? Please bring markers. When I uh, explain to what you should bring or talk in English, please, I always go from left to right. Okay, so I'll start with markers. You can choose whatever color you want. You can choose black, red, purple, green, yellow, or blue. Just one marker. You need a board, okay, so we can write and have some fun. A notebook, of course, and a pencil. Okay, now I want to tell you a very beautiful story. The, the name of the story is The Ant and the Bat. I don't want you to write anything. I just want you to listen very carefully, okay? So let's start. This is Auntie. Auntie is an ant. This is Betty. Betty is a bat. Auntie and Betty have a hat and a fan. Where are the hat and the fan? In the bag. Auntie and Betty like to nap. To nap. Where do they like to nap? On the sand. Okay. So let's look at the, some words that we heard in the story. We have the word ant, the word bat, the word hat, the word fan, the word bag, the word nap, and sand. Who can tell me which sound is the same in all of these words. Again, I will read them again. Please listen. Ant, bat, hat, fan, bag, nap, sand. Which so sound is the same in all of them? Can you, can you guess? Very good. Ah. The sound is ah. Sometimes it was in the beginning of the word and sometimes in the middle of the word. So when I say ant, it's in the beginning. Bat, it's in the middle. Now, this shape, this letter, is the, na the name of the letter is A, but the sound is A. Uh. Look at my mouth when I say A. Uh. Uh, I open my mouth very wide and I become very happy too. So I say A. Uh. Okay, say it with me. Ah, uh, very good. Again, ah, uh, very good. Okay, now we are going to try to work on how to read the words. Okay, sorry. First, I want to write the words. Please take your boards. Take your boards. 
and your markers and let's try to write the small a on your board it's very easy look with me so we start from here okay it's like a small circle we go above and we go down it's a circle and we go down okay that's the small a again very good so it's like a circle and we go down it's very easy and when you see the word you see the letter you see the sound you always hear ah okay now try to write on your little boards okay write it here okay write it here it's very easy and it's very fun to use your board at home okay so write here on these lines uh, and when you write it, please say the sound. Say, ah, uh, okay? So I do like this. I do it like this. Ah. Uh, again. Ah. Uh, very good. Okay. Great. Now, let's try to read the words. And what do we do with the word? The first word is ant. Ant, when we say the word ant, we talk about three sounds. We hear the sound a, n, t. So we put a, n, an, and it becomes ant. Great job. You tell, you, you say it. A, very good. N, an, t, ant. It becomes the word ant. Say the word ant. Very good. Say the word ant. Great job. Say the word ant. Great job. Ant. Great job. This is the word ant. The next one. Here we have the sound b, a, t, b, a, t. So we have b, a, which is ba, and it. We put it together becomes bat. This is bat. Say the word bat. Very good. Yes. B a and t. Again. B a and t. Very good. Bat. Say bat. 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 Very good. Do you like bats? They can fly. Yes. Okay. The next one is nap. Now, how do we read the word? We say n, a, which is na, n, a, na, and ip, nap. It's very easy. N, a, n, a, na. Then we put p, nap. Great job. Which is nap. Say nap. 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 Very good. Great students. The next one is sand. Let's listen to the word sand and see how many sounds do we hear. We hear s, a, n, d. So four sounds. We put s and a, sa, n, san, and sand. Very good. Say it with me. S. A, sa, say it. Great. N, san, you say it. Very good. Then d, sand. Great job. Sand. Say sand, sand. Okay. The next word is bag. We have three sounds. We have b, a, and ig. Okay? We have the b. A and ig. B, a, ba, ig, bag. You say it now. Try to say it with me. B, a, ba, ig, bag. Great job. Bag. This is a bag. Yes, I go to school, my school bag. I take my school bag with me. Bag. Yes. Okay, the next one is hat. The three sounds are a, t, i, a, ha, and it is hat. I, a, 
it is hat. Try with me. I and a, ha and it. I, a, ha, it, hat. The word is hat. Great job. Now fan. We have if, f, a, fa, and in. If a is fa and in is fan. You say it now. A, yes. And then in, what does it become? And fan, very good, a fan, fan, great job. Okay, now let's read the words again, okay? And look at the pictures too. So I say ant, this is an ant, it's very beautiful, small ant. Bat, yes. Nap, hat, sand, we can see sand on the beach. Fan, it's hot today. And bag. Okay, now it's a let's play a game. The game is what is missing. So here we have some pictures. I want you to look at them for 20 seconds, okay? Now, after you look at them, I will take one picture away, okay? I will take it off. So look at the pictures for 20 minutes. We have ant, sand, Nap, hat, bag, fan, and bed. Okay, now, look at this. Which picture is missing? What is missing? What disappeared? Yeah. Great, great answer. Hat was missing. Very good. Now, the next one. What is missing? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, great job. Fan is missing. Great job. The next one. What is missing? What is missing? Think, 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 think. What is missing here? What can't we see? Great job. Ant. Very good. Ant. The next one. Yeah, what is missing? Think. Mm. Can you know? Do you know? Can you tell what's missing? Do you know? Yes, sand is missing. Very good. You are wonderful students. Very good. Now, what is missing? Which word is missing? Come on, think, think, think. Yes, you can do it. Great job. Bag is missing. Very good. What is missing now? What is missing now? Yes, well done, well done. Nap was missing, very good. What is missing now? <laughs> Think, it's very easy, you can do it, you're very uh, smart. Yes, bat, the black bat, very good. Okay, here we have a new game, okay? We are going to read words, okay, that have the a sound, and I want you to do this. Bring your board, bring your board and your marker, and write the word gap on the board. So you put g, a, gap. Write the word gap on the board and then we will change. What does change mean? We'll take this sound and put something else and we'll make new, a new word. And then we will read together the new words. So here we have gap. Write gap on your board. Write it. Okay. And now we will make up new words from the word gap. Let's start. Okay, what is this? Cap, very good. Now, map, very good. Now we change the last sound, man, very good. Now, it's mab, very good. Gab, it's the name of a boy, gab. 
Gag. Who can read this one? Gap. Very good. Gan. Fan. Do you remember fan? Yes. Man. Okay. Well done. And pan. Yes. Gan again. <laughs> Gad is also a boy's name. And gab. Very good. Okay. Now, here are some words that we saw before. We have gap, cap, and map. And we have fan, man, and pan. These are our new words. So let's read them again. Gap, cap. And map. Fan, man, and pen. I want you to time when you read. It really helps you a lot. So say gap, cap, map. Fan, man, pen. Again, faster. Gap, cap, map. Fan, man, pen. Great job. Very good. Now, we are going to talk about. Rhyming friends. What does rhyming friends mean? Rhyming friends mean that words that have the same ending of the word. Okay? They only change uh, at the beginning. Okay? For example, we have fan. Now, if I change if into m, what word do I have? Man. So, these two words are Rhyming words, they rhyme, they have the same ending of the word, okay? So I have fan and man, okay? We have an, an, but we change if and im. The next one, hat. Let's think of a word that ends with at. We have hat and we have bat. Yes, hat and the bat. Very good. The next one. Sand. Okay, let's see what we change to, be, to make a new word. Band. So we have sand and band. Cap. What word can we make of cap? Yes, very good. Nap. Very good, students. Yes, so cap and nap are rhyming words. Okay, we have ant, the small ant. Now, this word is a bit different. Can't, okay? Okay, they rhyme. Can't, ant, can't, ant. Rhyming words, they sound the same. We can hear them the same. We say ant and can't, the same thing. Okay, now here we have an exercise, okay? The first one, I want you to listen very, very, very carefully, okay? We have bad. Listen, listen. Bad. We have sad. We have mad. And we have nap. Which word sounds different? Doesn't belong. Again, I will read the words. Bad. Sad. Mad. Nap. Okay, so which word doesn't belong? It's different. We don't, it sounds different. Very good. It's nap. Very good. What I want you to do now is to look at the other lines and choose one word in each line that sounds differently. Okay, isn't the same. Is not a rhyming friend. Okay, I'll give you two minutes to do so. Think very good.
Okay, time is out. Now, let's go to the next line. What did you answer? We have fat, hat, bat, and sand. So, which one is, uh, doesn't belong? Sounds differently. Sand, very good, very good. So, we have fat, hat, bat, sand. Sand is different, very good. The next one, we have fan, man, can, jam. Which one is different? Yes, very good. We have jam is different. Great job, great students. I'm very, very glad. The last one, nap, cap, bag, tap. Which one is different? Yes, great job. Bag is different. Great job. I'm very happy. Now, let's look at these words, okay? And uh, I'm going to read a word. I want you to choose which picture I'm talking about. So if I say the first word is bag, tell me which number is the word bag. So bag is number, yeah, please, yes, number four. Number four is bag. Great. The next word, hat. Which picture is the word hat? Yes, great job. Number five. Very good. The next one is, who can try to read it? Yes, it's ant. Which picture is the word ant? Yes, very good. Ant is number one. Yes, number one. The next word is nap. Which word is the word nap? Which picture is the word nap? Nap. Nap. Yes, number six. Very good. Great job. Wow, you are very smart. The next one is bat. Okay. Yes, number three. Very good. Great job. The next one is fan. Fan. Yes. Fan is number seven. Very good. The last word is sand. Sand. Okay. Yes. Sand is number two. Great job. You are very smart. I'm so happy. Okay. Here we have a matching exercise. What I want you to do is to match uh, the first sound to the last two. For example, I say n, number one is n. Put it with n app becomes nap, and we write the word nap in our notebooks. Okay. The next one is b. b. Now we'll choose the ending of the word to put them together. So b with which word comes? Very good with ag. So it becomes bat. So we have bat. Very good. Bat. Bat. Very good. Now I want you in your notebooks to match the first sound with the last sounds, the end of the word, and to make words we know. We learned them. I'll give you three minutes.
Okay. How was it? I'm sure you did very well because you are very smart students. Okay? Let's go to the third word. A. A goes to what ending? Yes, very good. To ant. So, ant, ant. Very good. The next one. Th, th goes to? Yes, great job. Th, and fan. Great. The word fan. Fan. The next one. Sa, d. Sa, d. Yes, great. Send. The last one. B. B. Great job. B goes to ag. So bag. Great job. Very good. Now I want you to look at the text to read by yourself and circle all the words that have the a ah sound. A ah words. Okay? Try. Try to circle them. Circle. Put a circle on them. Okay? So let's start. Okay? I'll help you. Don't worry. You can do it. Auntie is an ant. Betty is a bat. Auntie and Betty have a hat, a fan in the bag. Auntie and Betty can nap on the sand. So which words have the a ah sound? Let's start. Great. So auntie is the first one. A ah, auntie. The next one. Ant. Great job. Ant too. And ant has the a. Ah. I say ant. The next one. Betty. Betty is a bat. So Betty, a, ah, we can hear the a ah in the word. The next one. Great job. Bat. Bat. We hear the a ah in the middle. A, ah, bat. Great job. Yes. Great job. Hat. Excellent job. Hat. Someone else? Great. Fan. A ah, fan. Fan. Yes. Bag. Okay, bag, great. Look how you know some words. Great job. You can read them, you can say the words. Great job. Can, yes. Nap, great job, great. Sand, great. So all of these words, we know, we learn them in this lesson. Now, I want to read it again, and I want you to put, to circle new words that you can hear the a. Ah. Listen very carefully. So I say, auntie is an ant, Betty is a bat. Auntie and Betty have a hat and a fan in a bag. Auntie and Betty can nap on the sand. What words did we hear? What word do we hear? The a ah sound. Great. We have and and have too. Okay? Look how easy it is. You just need to listen and to look very carefully. Great job. Now, what can you do? You deserve a clap. Great job. Now you can say the short a. Ah. Now you can match rhyming words like fan and van and you can read new words. Great job. It was very, 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 very lucky to teach you. Stay healthy and goodbye.